Hi! Omega Chaos again. This time with a, a heroic channel shell tech profile. Uh, this tech is uh, extremely aggressive. Uh, you want to bring out your number 86 heroic champion wrong me out with as much uh, exist materials as possible. Of course it's a uh, play that requires a lot of resources. So you have to be very careful with this deck. But of course you have a lot of other plays as well. But this is the uh, uh, yeah, main monster you want to bring out in this deck. So let's go with this deck. First are the uh, two uh, uh, OCC World Premier cards aside from uh, number 86. So uh, three Heroic Chance and Assault Halbert. It's like a Photon Drasher of the deck and it also uh, can search a Heroic card when it defeats uh, battle damage. And it also can inflict personal damage as well, so it's an extremely uh, good card for this deck. Definitely uh, brings this deck uh, more consistency. Then another key card is a Heroic Chancel Thousand Plates. You can discard a Heroic card to put on a Heroic monster from a deck. And if you do, uh, you change this card to defense position. But you cannot put on any monster for the rest of it. That's this turn except the heroic monsters so yeah and, you, and if you take damage uh, from attack or card effect when this card is in the graveyard we can press on this card in face of attack position you can only use the effect once per turn so then with really good variance of the summon your uh, number 86 so really good card for this deck for sure then the other heroic monsters uh free heroic chance at double lands uh, if you normal summon it, you can summon another uh, double lance from your uh, hand or grave out in face of defense. It cannot be used as Swing Material Monster, and uh, if you use the Exist Material, you, that Exist Monster you summon into has to be a warrior type. But that isn't uh, too much of a restriction, because most of the monsters you want to summon in this deck are warriors, so yeah. Another really good monster in this deck is a uh, free hero chance of extra sword. If you exist one, uh, if this card that the exist monster gains a uh, thousand attacks, so very nice. And the last hero monster is hero chance of Spartan. Once per turn, when one monster declines attack, you enter at one face of hero monster you control, except this card, and then this card gains attack equal to the uh, face of monster's original attack until the end of the battle phase. So. And not uh, the greatest heroic monster, but that still can be pretty good, so yeah. The other monsters mostly help you spam out more warriors, so you can yeah, get more access material for your number 86. Uh, a free Goblin Berg, just uh, no more so and you can press on a level 4 monster, level 4 lower monster from my hand, and then you discard this change to defense position. So, have to make uh, more access summons. And then... Uh, Free Blue Mountain Potter Spy, which is like a warrior version of Kahat Kage. So if you know someone a warrior mo type monster, you can press on this card from my hand. But it cannot be used as Swings Material Monster and cannot be normal summoned. So it's definitely really good in this deck it's, because it's also a warrior monster. So better than Kahat Kage in this deck for sure. Then the spells uh, two reinforcement armo army. Of course, it's a warrior deck. So yeah. Then two warrior returning alive. Just to recycle your heroic, essential heroic, heroic monsters. Uh, two uh, Inferno Reckless Summon, a huge combo card to get out uh, more monsters. Uh, most you want to activate it uh, when you spell someone extra sword, then you can get two more. And then your uh, number 86 can gain a lot, of, a lot of attack as well, so that's very nice. And uh, then uh, Phobia Last to protect your uh, essential monsters from spells and traps. Two Musical Space Typhoon. And Dark Horn, not traps. Uh, two Battle Guard Holding, because it's uh, of course a warrior attack. If a uh, warrior type monster you control is target for an attack or by opponent's mass effect, you can target one face of monster upon controls. If you damage the uh, opponent, they could the original attack. And uh, if you do it, you return it to the hand, so it's like a compulse or a evocation device and a magic cylinder in one, so that's very nice. Then the other depth, Swallow Morning, a bottom of trap hole, a commercial evocation device, two flash chain, and finally two trap stun, of course, it makes huge combo blades, so a back row can uh, yeah, stop you, so 
Capstone is really nice to lock down your points back. Up. Then extra deck, uh, 2 and uh, number 86. Here, Champion Ongamia, the key guard of the deck, of the deck, the ultimate boss monster. Uh, it, it requires 2 or more, uh, maximum 5, a uh, level 4 warrior type monsters. So, then, uh, to engage your opponent's uh, end phase, detach one excess material from this card. This card gains a fix based on the number of excess materials attached to it. One or more, this card can, can, can be destroyed by battle. Uh, two or more, this card gains 1500 attack and defense. Uh, three or more, this card is unaffected by other card effects, so that's extremely powerful. Uh, four or more, your opponent card no more spells on, so locks them down, but they can still uh, set cards, of course, set their monsters. And then five or more, once per turn you can destroy all the cards your opponent controls. That the last effect is definitely very massive. Just destroy everything your opponent has on the field. And then uh, your opponent can carry out the normal spells one. And uh, this card is unaffected by other card effects, so your opponent really can't do much. But ideally, you summon it with five materials, which is very hard to do. But still, extremely powerful card, really good, really powerful. But of course, it's uh, very risky to bring uh, this card out, of course, with. Uh, Many materials, your black horn or solar warning will completely destroy you then, and then you will cry most likely. So, then another Axis Monsters, your champion Kusanagi, which requires three level 4 warriors, and during Ilbra's turn, when a trap card is activated, you can touch one Axis Monster from this card and negate the activation, and if you do, destroy it, and then this card gains 400 attack. So, really good card against a trap card, so that's uh, very nice, I think. And not very hard to summon in this deck. Then here are Champion Gondiva, uh, which destroys uh, level 4 lower monsters when they are spells on, uh, except when you damage them. So, yeah, that's uh, pretty good, I think, against certain decks. Then uh, 2 here are Champion Excalibur, the main beater of the deck. You touch 2 Axis Matters, then uh, this has attacking as a double of, of its original attack on the, your opponent's end, next end phase. So, big one becomes a uh, 4000 attack beta and your opponent's uh, next turn's end phase. Then uh, Comic Hero King Card 4, which also is a uh, Exis Matter Trek Card Warriors. If this card will be destroyed by battle, it attacks one Exis Matter instead. And if you do, uh, it gains a far attack. And if it does, it inflicts far damage to your opponent. So I think it's pretty decent. Then I uh, play Dawn Ninja. Basically, a double attack of the deck and uh, very nice for our next, yeah, OTK plays. And of course, it gains, uh, if we ex use uh, extra sword, it gains strong attack, so you can inflict, inflict even more damage with this card. Then, number 13, Utopia, just because, in, just in case, uh, with a warrior Xyz. Then, other Xyz monsters, Dark Reaper and Xyz Dragon, can become a huge builder, really good. Uh, Cargon, Ultimate Knight, also really good, can re redirect uh, targets, and with extra sword it becomes even more of a problem for your opponent. Number 1, one Sato Arc, of course, really powerful. Costa, the Sky Blast Musketeer, probably the more best, uh, rank 4 in the game. Uh, Even next Knight, of course, and finally Kaga Cowboy, and it's also a Warrior uh, type X monster. So, this was my Heroic Challenger uh, deck profile. It's definitely really interesting deck. Probably still needs uh, uh, more support to be competitive. So, yeah. So, I hope you enjoyed this deck profile. Uh, for now, uh, good point on my Out.